you're watching Backyard Tech. The work week for some people is probably slowly drawing to a close. You've only got a couple of days left and then you're in the weekend for the clear, considering the fact that tomorrow's Friday, making today Thursday. That might make some people happy. Mind you, old mate's got a bit of news regarding here at home for the Thursday promo. Some people are going to be really happy about the fact that today's going to be quiet here at Backyard Tech. Others won't be. Let's get into the Thursday promo. Morning all. Well, it is Thursday, second last day of the working week for those that work Monday to Friday. The work week is, for some people, probably slowly drawing to a close. For others, well, they probably feel like there's still about 10 days to go before the weekend arrives. Um, it's uh, just on up past seven in the morning here. And before we get into the rest of the Thursday promo and uh, other little bit of news, Now, the reason I need this this morning is because old mate was dead set in the fed income department lazy and slept through his alarm. So if that's the way you are this morning, here's the remedy. Coffee time. Oh, geez, I need that this morning, let me tell you. All right, well, first off the, right off the meat of the bat, you may notice it's a little brighter in here. I have lights again. Now the job's not finished, um, but as you can see, I do have lights here. I've got the light above my head's going again, which is really, really good. Um, the, re the good and bad news. The good news is I have lights. The bad news is the only other thing coming up here at Backyard Tech for today will be tonight's live stream. The Sparky's got to come back. Um, he was here till late yesterday. And didn't get the job completely finished. Um, funnily enough, <laughs> as I say, funnily enough, the problem was what I thought it was, which was one cable to a power point up behind the TV in the lounge room was the whole problem. Um, so the job's not done, which means he's got to come back. They've got to reinspect what to do with that specific cable. Um, the good thing is, is the office, the garage the lounge room and our bedroom is now all on one circuit um, so which is really good he fitted a 35 amp RCD um, switch but he was actually quite surprised how much power I pull here in the office for the main PC uh, the amp the mixing desk and one of the two IMAX in actual fact I only pull 460 watts which isn't that bad considering so um that's sort of the state of play so as you can see it's a little bit brighter in here now only the fact i've got the light above my head again which also makes it easy for me to see the keyboard and everything else um but that this is probably it for the day uh as i said the spark is coming back i don't know how long he's going to be um they may have to relay one circuit or re completely rewire one circuit i don't know but uh it's nice to have lights back in here. What, three weeks without them? <laughs> so far, I guess you could say. So there we go. Anyway, guys, enjoy your Thursday. I will catch you tonight for the convo. 7 p.m. Australian Eastern Daylight Time GMT UTC plus 11. Uh, apologies for last night. If, you, um, want, if you're not part of the Backyard Tech Facebook group, make sure you check out the community page here at Backyard Tech because... Um, I'll put on both what the go is. But finally, my electrical problems are being sorted out. The other thing that was interesting too, we found one area of this circuit, especially here, that was causing the hum issue. Not the hum you're hearing now, which is the Yamaha and the PC, but the earth hum, um, which funnily enough was being caused by this same circuit that's been giving me all the problems. 
so I'm hoping some of the problems may soon get fixed entirely. And my audio will be back to a reasonable standard. Now, a good friend of mine over there in Seattle knows that I'm not overly impressed with my audio at the moment, but we're getting there. So there we are. Thursday promo done. Enjoy your Thursday, guys, and I'll catch you tonight for the convos. As always, I really can't say have a good one. What I will say is try to have a good one all. Cheers.